Hi everyone, welcome to a new episode of Timothy's Toy Therapy. My name is Timothy and today I would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land on which I am recording this video from and that is the Wurundjeri people of the Kulin Nation and I would like to pay my respects to their elders past and present. Today I will be showing you everything that I received from Doll Junk. He and I both live in the same city, so yeah, we catch up every now and then, usually the day after pay, because we go and check out the stores around town, around Melbourne. I had some dolls for him, and he had some dolls for me. He also got me that Draculaura. I paid him for it, and he got it at the store. So she was pretty great to have. Today, we're just going to have a look at the dolls that he got me. Um, and if you're all wondering, this is my mini-me, and I paid him to customise him to look more like me. So, thank you so much for that doll trunk. Now, some of the dolls that he had in the bag, which was a big bag, contained some for Ethan, Barbie's GBF. This one wasn't one of them but i asked ethan if he had him he is actually the same one as my mini me that's that's the the change so i asked him if he wanted it uh, and he said yes so this one's going to ethan he is a fashionista i'm not sure his number so next up we have the basketball player made to move that uses the same head sculpt as the barbie extra 20 uh the crystal head sculpt she is possibly the same skin tone as tiffany is i think um yeah and i don't know if i'm gonna rebody this doll or keep her this way uh i haven't done that with the other ones that i had of her i think she's the basketball player uh or the soccer player one of the one one of the two but yeah that's her next up we've got two curvy dancers uh they're made to move i will definitely be rebodying i don't like the curvy made to moves or the talls um talls for more than one reason but the curvies because they've got feet that do not fit most shoes that you get for barbie and they're really hard to style with shoes so he also gave me two megaras from hercules i think i already have this one i've got two of her ethan sent me two um with their hair in a state like this one one of one of them has good hair actually um, and that's the one that i've got on a made to move body and she's all good and then there's this one and she doesn't have a side glance she's really pretty and she's got a really beautiful dress as well. So yeah, and earrings. So I also got this Mbli and I really love her. I actually have her as well. But this one looks like a better screening so I may end up replacing that one with this one. I'm pretty sure she was a fashionista. She's on a old fashionista uh, articulated body. And if I do replace she will be getting the other ones made to move body. He also gave me this Daisy who he has put some tattoos on. She looks pretty wicked. I don't have Daisy like this, so I think I'm going to keep her uh, and dress her. Oh, well, maybe not even change what she's wearing. She's got flat feet. She's not a... Oh, her legs don't even bend, so she's on some kind of body that doesn't have articulated legs. They do at the hip. Uh, but yeah, she looks really cool. I love, I, I, I kind of love it. I'm not gonna make all my dolls tattered, but she looks good this way. So next up, we have this gorgeous Lara. I really like her with brunette hair and I've wanted to create a brunette uh, well a laura brannigan um 
Barbie out of a Lara head sculpt. And I may just do it with this one, because <laughs> she looks pretty good. Uh, yeah, so that is Lara. I don't know who she is other than that. Gold Junk will probably tell me in the comments below. So another next up is this crystal. I think this is crystal. I really love the way she looks. She's got glasses. I'm not sure if this is a fashionista or not. Um, she's got a yellow top black skirt they're sewn together and this really cool denim vest with stickers I actually do like. Um, nice curly hair, it's a bit boxy but yeah nice and she's got glasses and then her shoes are these hot pink, maybe not hot pink but I'm not saying hot as in hot pink, I'm saying hot as in hot pink heels. Oh, and a little hot pink bag. He also passed on a man bun, and I'm pretty sure he's the old man bun, not the new one. But yeah, he's on a broad body, and that's him. All right, so this one's pretty cool. It is Wonder Woman. She looks freaking evil, to be honest, but I love her. And she'll get a made to move body and she is going to mess shit up because she looks amazing. This one's a little bit shady, I think. <laughs> it's, um, it is covered in glitter. But this is the Bubby Extra that I reviewed the other week. And I, I don't know what to do with her because I've got her. He also gave me this one. I do have her. She's styled really well. Um... So, she, she, I don't want to give her to Savers, I may give her to my niece. He also gave me this sick outfit on a Fresh Squad body, who I'm going to use for one of my Ken dolls. Now, I know it's not a perfect match, but we've wanted a body for this guy for a while. Bus seat print can, it's not a perfect match, but it's pretty close and I'm just gonna, you know, one, two, three, pop. Ah, yeah, amazing. I think he looks pretty good with that body and now I can actually pose him. Oh my God, that's so awesome. This can is really cool. I'm really excited about this one. Uh, because I now have a father. <laughs> this is going to be my voodoo Ken for my dad. Um, looks kind of similar to him. And definitely looks older than my mini-me. So yeah, it's great. He's uh, Happy Families or something like that, Ken. So yeah. And on the topic of Kens while we speak is this guy... Henry Higgins. I now have the full My Fair Lady set. I am so happy to have him. I've got to find an outfit for him, but he is awesome. Last but not least, out of the ones that I am not giving to Barbie's GBF, he can review them himself, is this Raquel. I've had a really good couple of weeks with getting some really good Raquel dolls. I've got to fix her hair up. I've got to find an outfit that is uh, shunty enough for her. But yeah, I love it. Thank you so much, Doll Junk, for all these dolls. Um, thank you everyone for watching and I, I'll, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.